G'day and welcome to Scrap Mechanic uh, Creative. Um, I've been toying up with the probability of using a gimbaled um, truck hitch that we um, that you see out in the real world, um, and I've come up with this. I've actually used a bearing in the centre here to be the rotation. So you have a look at this; um, it's on an angle. And then you can see that it's actually pointing downwards towards the back of the truck as well. So there's a pivot point there as well. So here's my trailer. I've got automated uh, leg supports on it. So when the arm, when the lock arm here swings in to hold the trailer pin, the logic sensor says, yep, lift up the legs. And then we've got a suspension piece on here as well. So when the sensor breaks connection, um, the logic will fire up and power the rear wheels of the trailer. So I've got two engines in here just to make um, power trim a bit easier for myself. Um, and you can see that the wheels on the trailer also have some movement in relation to everything else. So uh, they've got this little bit of an arm which is connected up to the suspension in the middle. The middle tire is actually fixed. It's just a... a um, a waypoint for the connection um, and then it's the same on the other side and the same on the rig itself so when we're looking at the rear tires the center tire doesn't move in relation to the ground only the forward and rear tires do um, and then we've just got a couple of extra stops on the rotation of the gimbal of the trailer hitch so we can see how it all goes so let's see if I can get this reverse first go um, so I've got the, the hitch to be extra wide and you'll actually see as we slide under, am I in the right spot yet? As we slide under, we hook in and we're very positive about it. Because we've got the trailer powered by uh, engines, the, um, the trailer actually has brakes as well. So I've just fired that pin across to lock the trailer on. So it's all pulled up forward and we're good to go. So let's see if... Um, we can get this working. I'll give myself a long shot. So as we move away from the trailer, the trailer engines will power on. I've got them set to a slightly lower pace for us. Um, but you can see all through here, um, it's all quite manageable. The gimbal and suspension piece on the trailer hitch are really working hard. Um, and you know we can travel around on this reasonable terrain. Um, without any worry at all just on that actually flat out actually um, so I'm pretty pretty excited um, yeah so it's all just a prototype truck um, just showing off the suspension that I've been uh, trialing um, because the problem is if we use uh, normal suspension that we use in the game oh, I'll pay attention to what I'm doing um, when we use normal suspension uh, in for a truck and we travel quickly to the side all of the wheels on one side of your rig are able to collapse under the sh under the movement of the suspension. So without actually having any anti-sway uh, mechanisms, you can roll your truck over easily. So by having the fixed um, center wheel, oh, I'm not moving. Oh, I've come undone. Um, by having the fixed center wheels, um, it actually alleviates the roll uh, a lot. So I'll just get ourselves moving. There we go. Just come off the hitch, um, just slid off the hitch a little bit. So, um, yeah, but normally you wouldn't be torturing the uh, the truck hitch to this extent. Um, so you can see there we've got some roll going, some of the pivot action going. Um, yeah, so that trailer hitch has a, quite a lot of movement in it, considering, um, you know, what we're trying to do. And um, the trailer itself, by having those extra wheels move around, uh, gives us that extra advantage. And the power. Um, yep, release the truck, release the trailer, and we're good, good to go. And now I have um, a, a scout vehicle that's, um, you know, it's a bit hilarious to, to drive around, um, but it's um, viable. Um, so I'm thinking of uh, making this my um, survival um, rig and trailer uh, combo. So I hope you guys enjoy it. It's just a, uh, a prototype. Um, and before I cover it all up with, with a skin and all that sort of stuff, um, you don't get a chance to see all of that 
on some creations. So I thought I'd give, give you guys a view of the prototype. Thanks, hope you enjoyed.